Shelby County Commissioner is sharing his story tonight after he believes a large object was dropped from an interstate overpass, damaging his car. A surprise, and tonight, while his car is waiting to be fixed, he says it could have been much worse. WRG's Shea Arthur is live to explain. Shay, what exactly is going on here? Well, Stephanie said right there, really, this could have been so much worse. And really, it's pretty alarming. He said it happened right here in this area off the Getwell overpass. And tonight, he has a message for the public. Take a look. A large gash in glass. A sunroof shattered. Just going about my regular day, just like yeah. anyone else. Shelby County Commissioner Reginald Milton says Tuesday morning, he drove along I-240 under the Getwell overpass. I think I noticed someone. It was just, you know, when you're not paying attention, and it looked like that person was being very visual in their, their movement and and as soon as I went under the uh, the bridge I heard this huge boom sound initially he wasn't sure if he hit something and then all of a sudden I started hearing glass just running off my car he pulled over to find the large hole in the sunroof it's obvious someone had thrown something off the bridge onto the car and uh, fortunately I had my sunscreen which, you know, covers it. If it hadn't, all that glass would have just gone right into my car and I might have lost control. Lost control, something getting your eye, exactly. Absolutely, absolutely. Milton isn't exactly sure what the object was, but knows things could have ended much worse. He's now dealing with a list of issues. One, figuring out how to make sure the hole is covered before it rains again. He shared a warning about his experience on social media, saying something someone might think is a joke could leave a much bigger impact. To any young person to think before you act because you could take a life. Also saying while we constantly get bombarded with bad news and warnings, things to look out for. The reality is, is that life is a challenge. It's, it, it comes with risk and you, you have to live with that and you can't let it frighten you. You can't let it paralyze you. You have to move on. You know, the truth is, is that I'll have this fixed and I'll move on with my life. But we should always be careful and be mindful of what's going on around us. Yeah, certainly a good message there. Stephanie Gray, get this. Milton says his insurance company told them it could take weeks, if not a month, before a fix could be made. We're live in East Memphis tonight. Shay Arthur, WREG News Channel 3. All right, looking out for the unexpected. Thank you, Shay.